It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Tranquil and it's their house ale coming in at 7.2% ABV. You can purchase this beer at Flavorly.com. Flavorly do a great range of craft ales. It's, it's a monthly beer club you can join or you can just go on their website and buy some beer if you like. They got Brewdog, they've got some Williams Brothers, they got this and they've got some great, great beers. So check out Flavorly.com. Also, check out their food. I've been eating a little, they've sent me a box of food down and I've been eating some corn and some sweet potato chips and it's been great. So that's worth trying. Oh, and their ginger coffee. The ginger coffee is great. But going back to this beer, before I open it, I've got a quick story. Don't go away. I judged in a competition in Ludlow, in England, about three years ago. Uh, Travelling on the train from Wales, I met this lovely old gentleman, proper English gentleman with, a, with a, one of them nice kind of bowler hats and he had a suit on. Very well dressed gentleman. And we got talking and he asked me where I was going and I said I'm going to judge in Lund, uh, Ludlow. I'm a beer judge, I, I judge around the country. Um, I've judged in Europe and wow he's over the moon uh, over the moon I, I told him what I do on YouTube I review some beer and he said I'm a collector I collect things and funny you should say about real ales and, and beers and because they can becoming very popular and he said that um, this Tranqua Tranquere brewery or it's a tranquil house. They started to produce beer, and they produced a limited selection of a beer, which it was something like a hundred bottles, and it was extremely rare. And he bought two bottles, and he's put it in his cellar. And um, so, I, I tried to get the beer three years ago. I tried to get the beer, couldn't get it, uh, couldn't find it, and then lo and behold, Flavorly.com, their craft beer club, now has it available. Never tried it, not tried any of their beer, I'm looking forward to trying it, but if you enter Real Ale in the coupon section on the website, flavorly.com, you'll get a 10% discount on all of your orders. So, a nice smoky opening. So three years of anticipation to try a beer. I hope it lives up. To the expect expectation. Okay, so the head slightly off white, tan coloured, beer in the glass is a deep amber, very dark brown beer, nice roaring carbonation. I'm not sure if there you go, you can see that carbonation roaring up from the bottom of the glass. It's a copper, dark, mahogany, clear coloured beer. Let's get the aroma. Slightly rummy, malty, chewy, toffee. British, English hop. Kind of that hedgerow fruit hop. Slightly lemony. Let's dive in. Cheers. Oh. Oh yeah. The aroma was nice, the taste, the feel, the complexity. It's like a fur coat when you drop when you drink the beer. It wraps around you. It hugs you in the cold. It's a warming beer. You got a slight kick of alcohol from that 7.2%.
it's medium bodied in the mouthfeel it's quite carbonated but it's chewy sticky toffee it's bready malt it's a slight rum character kicking with that little bit of alcohol it's also refreshing it's nutty it's bitter on the back end it's sweet to begin with yeah it's lived up to the expectation it really has it's quality the famous beer gates closed since 1745 when the last person to pass through then was Bonnie Prince Charlie pardon me and that's all that kind of that ends there um, so basically it's a closed house uh, a potent liquor as brewed by the Lord in the ancient brew house of the oldest inhabited house in Scotland. So, it sounds like it's still a private house, and they've decided they've got this ancient brewery, they've decided to start brewing it again. Um, perhaps it's like the Trappist breweries. Um, not that it's a trap, I'm not trying to say it's a Trappist brewery, I'm trying to say that. It might help with the income of this building to keep it going to to keep like like the monks with the monasteries they try and keep it going they produce beers chocolates cheeses this is a similar thing just to keep this place going keep it private I imagine they've started to brew beer uh, the ingredients are spring water malt hops and yeast I wouldn't expect anything else and it's saying to serve at room temperature or slightly chilled excellent accompaniment to game meat and cheese very English very Scottish um, yeah I think they've done a good job they've done a good job of that you can get that at flavorly.com now bear in mind I'm not sure how many bottles of this they've got it took me three years to get the beer so if you if you like me you've been looking for the beer Go and find it on Flavely.com. Rating then for this lovely chestnut mahogany coloured beer. I really like it. I've given you my description. I won't go back over what I mentioned earlier. But I'll go ahead and give this an 8 out of 10. It's an 8 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Put your comments in the comments box, please subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers.